my name is Jonathan Smith. I grew up in uh, Lotoka, born in Suva, lived around all over the place, but grew up in Lotoka, went to Dras Avenue School and Natambua High School. Um, yeah, from there I was straight out to sea, did my cadetship on big container ships and bulk carriers and uh, ended up becoming third officer, second officer, and chief officer, and captain for now here in Fiji. So I grew up, you know, spear fishing, fishing, diving. I've been diving now for about, I don't know, 20 years or something. So before that, above the ocean, you never realize what's underneath until you start diving. So yeah, it was kind of interesting. That's what got me really hooked was the underwater world. I won't lie, I love kawakawa and dodu. You know, I love it. And that's one of the best fish. I like it better than Senka and Ongo and all the other fish. I mean, no one's going to disagree with me. You know, but the thing is, if we want to keep on eating it, if we want our kids to keep on to try it, then we've got to be sustainable. We've got to be able to um, be smart about it. The government's got to come in with tough laws. They've got to include the Golingoli owners, the villages, the people, the fishermen, you know, educate the people that buy fish, the middlemen, all of these. It's, it's, a, big, uh, it's a big job, it's not easy. You can't stop people from fishing. A lot of people like to fish. A lot of people like to eat fish. It's healthy, it's there. Um, but the, the, the magic word is sustainable fishing. To be able to sustain the stocks. You know, like in Palau, with the fines and the enforcements that's there, you wouldn't even dream, you know, of even dropping a line in the water to even, you even frighten that the cow cow might bite it. And the Palau is, they've got their stuff sorted. They still eat fish, they still eat cow cow and don't know, they can still catch it, but outside of the season. I'd like to think of myself as an environmentalist, not a tree hugger kind of a thing, but at least, you know, be sensible about the environment, whether it be in the ocean or on the land, or whether it's rubbish or overfishing and things like that. Um, I like to spread the word. 